today a delicious Tuscan panzanella salad. Amazing. So let's do it. The first step with this recipe, pop your oven on and preheat to about 120 degrees. And then we want some bread. You can use stale bread, but personally I like to bake off some fresh bread until it's nice and toasty, similar to croutons. So take the bread, chop that up into small cubes, and then you want to pop the bread onto a baking tray or a roasting tin, pop it into the oven, and you basically just want to bake that off until it's nice and crispy but without any colour. So keep checking it every 5-10 minutes. Soon as it's really nice and crispy, get that out of the oven and just leave that to cool down for about 10 or 15 minutes before we put together our salad. Next up, we want some red onions. So take your onions and a really sharp knife and you want to chop your onions in half, remove the skins and then for this recipe we want to dice up the onions into nice long thin strips, similar to how you would julienne a pepper. So slice up your onions and then you want to chuck those into a large mixing bowl. Next you want to chuck in some of your bread. So get your bread in the bowl with the onions and give that a really good mixing up and then some cherry tomatoes. Use some really good quality cherry tomatoes and you simply want to chop them in half and chuck those into the bowl with the onion and the bread. Give everything a really good mixing up and then we want some lovely fresh parsley. You want to dice up your parsley really nice and fine and chuck a good handful into the bowl and then some lovely aromatic fresh basil. So dice up your basil nice and fine and chuck a handful of that into the bowl along with the parsley and the rest of the ingredients. Give it a good mix and then you want to season with some salt and some freshly ground black pepper and then give everything a really good drizzle in some good quality extra virgin olive oil and then give it a good splash with some lovely zingy balsamic vinegar. Give it one last really good mix through and there we have the most amazing Tuscan bread salad panzanella. All that's left to do is to get stuck in and I'll see you next time.